So this is my friend Adele. Hey, so this is Ed's vlog that he uses to share his life with you. And also, quite selfishly, to motivate him to make his life the life he wants it to be. Exactly. It's Wednesday today and the last 36 hours of my life have looked pretty much like this. I want to talk a little bit about the biggest struggle that I have in my life as a human being and how I've identified that and how I overcame that struggle or rather how I'm trying to overcome that struggle. It's a struggle that not a lot of people talk about and I kind of feel like I'm the only one that has the struggle. It's not alcohol, it's not drugs, it's not pornography. <clears throat> it's discipline. The biggest struggle that I have in my life is discipline. I have the hardest time being disciplined in all the stuff that I need to do. It's a real struggle for me to focus and work hard and keep it up for a whole day. And because of that struggle with discipline, my business is impacted, my life is impacted. It's just bad. It was something that I identified last year and knew that I had to get over and something that I had to overcome. So I heard about David Allen, who's like the, he's like the world's productivity guru. And he wrote a book called Getting Things Done. I tried to read that book, it was impossible. So I read another book and it totally changed my life. I'm not going to bother going into everything that I learned, but one of the most important things that I learned was how important a morning routine is. I also learned how important it is to know exactly what you need to get done in a day and then plan out exactly where in the day you're going to do that. And the best way I found to do that is with one of these. It's my notebook. Almost a year ago, I became entirely dependent on one of these. This thing basically runs my life. Anything that I ever think of gets written down in this notebook. Anything that needs to get done gets written down there. And at night before I go to sleep, I write down everything about the next day. I usually start by writing down the tasks that are most important that need to get done and then other tasks that also need to get done. And then I plan out exactly when in the day I'm going to do these tasks. This page right here is like the cornerstone of me surviving and getting stuff done in my business. If I don't have this page, I will play PlayStation all day. Now because they're so thin, they tend to only last me about three or four weeks and then I have to get a new one. That's why I got a couple new ones yesterday. I carry that notebook around with me everywhere I go in case something comes into my mind that needs to go in there. Otherwise, stuff just falls apart. Okay, so I hope to get into a bit more detail about all of that later. 
But all of this that's going on now is for a shoot that I'm doing just now. And I'm quite stoked about it. It's gonna be good. What's up? Good to see you again. Cool, bro. That, that right eye of yours is crazy, dude. <laughs> is it shaky? <laughs> it's like going like yeah. this. <laughs> you got your crazy eye going on. on this <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Okay, we need to do more of that. <laughs> we need to do more of that. Cheers. Dude, it was you. awesome. Cheers, bro. It was Cheers. Good to meet you. Winning. Take care of yourself. Give me a hug. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I like that. I love this studio and I love shooting here, but I hate packing all of this up when I'm done. I hate it. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Okay. Right, I've never had a lychee. I've never had an olive. An olive? A glass of milk. Like just a glass of milk. I've had you? like chocolate milk, but I've never had a glass of milk. Last time I had custard was 25 years ago, and, and, and I took a sip of it, and it just, and it just, oh, I've never had a boiled egg. Yo, eggs. There's lots, like there's a lot of stuff I've never had. So this is super quick. I came here for a puncture which was supposed to cost me a hundred rand. Instead, I paid this guy's bill, which was nine and a half thousand rand. <laughs> It was all an accident. Thanks, I, I super was quick. So excited! I thought I got a bargain. <laughs> <laughs> Have a nice day. Same to you. Thank you, sir. Okay. Okay, so we're here because we're shooting a wedding today. This is what shooting a wedding looks like. Ready? Table photos. Bride. Wedding ceremony. Couple photos. Reception. Are you the photographer? I might be the photographer. It all depends what that means to you. No, it's good because I Facebook stalked your, your page. Did, did you like it? I loved it. I then absolutely... I am the photographer. Oh my <laughs> word, it's so good to meet you. <laughs> oh, dude, I love dogs so much. I love dogs so much. Shan, come look at this. Yes. No! 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 I feel hot. I feel very hot. Happy Valentine's Day. Hi. Hello, you little mustard. Hi. Happy Valentine's Day. Thanks. I don't really know how I feel about Valentine's Day, to be honest. But... <laughs> it's but another day we can hang out. But I know that Shan would feel special if we did something nice, so... <laughs> so today we're taking a trip down memory lane. And it all started here at this restaurant. We, we came to this restaurant and I spent two hours bitching about my ex-girlfriend to her. <laughs> that was how this relationship started. And I was like, I am never going to date this guy. Okay, so this is week one of the vlog. This is my week last week. Technically, that was week two because I did film the week before that, but I did a terrible job. But some interesting stuff happened that week and I don't want to exclude that, so it's coming into this video. One of the interesting things that I did was a shoot with my friend Ed with Fuji's X-Pro2, which isn't out yet. And the shoot went great and the photos came out great and it looked like this. So this wall over here is actually the main place where I want to shoot. This looks pretty cool. Okay, so what I'm really excited about today is that I'm shooting this on Fujifilm's X-Pro2. You actually can't buy this camera yet. And uh, they gave me one to test. I'm stoked for this. Oh, what boy. is up, Ed? How's it What's going, up, dude? dude? I'm cool, bro. Yeah, it's too dark for the GoPro. Thank you so much, Thank I appreciate you. your time. Have a good one. The second thing that was interesting that week 
was that I introed my girlfriend Shan to this vlog and we celebrated her birthday. So this lovely woman is my girlfriend. How long have we been together? Too long. It's like four years? Yes. Aww. Her name is Shan. Hi. And it's her birthday tomorrow, but we're going to be busy the whole day tomorrow, so we're celebrating today. Are we? Yes. Tonight? Today. Yeah. Today is a celebration. She doesn't know it yet, but today is a celebration. Yes. <laughs> Vlogging like this is so difficult. There's so much that I didn't consider when I started this, and it's so tricky, but I kind of feel like I'm getting the hang of it. This week is a little bit better. I think next week will be a better one. What video is that? This is a video that I'm sending to Chinese uh, porn sites. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm just joking. <laughs> hey, <laughs> this is Ed's vlog that he 